So what's good YouTube, it's your boy Six Shot and the Six Shot Gaming Channel and today I have a video breaking down exactly step by step how to do Broly's Touch of Death combo and I also have ever basic B&B &B combos that you want to do with Broly. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you do enjoy this video and learn something new, please smash the like button. Also if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and check out some of the past content. Anyways, let's go. So this is Broly's touch of death combo and there's certain secrets to this combo you need to with the first hit of the auto combo because it's this damage scaling trick in this game with every character so you need to with the first hit of the auto combo the light auto combo and you're able to get touch of death by doing exactly this combo so right now we are gonna go by exactly all the inputs that I did right now so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to whiff the first hit of our light attack. Then we follow with the second light attack down medium into a quarter circle forward and the key blast button. And from there, you're going to do a delayed medium into a standing heavy into a quarter circle forward and a light attack button. And then you're going to cancel directly into your alternate level three super. From there, you're going to let the super does what it do. And you're going to touch the floor, wait a couple seconds, touch the floor. And from there, you're going to do a standing medium into a standing heavy into a quarter circle for a light attack again. And then you're going to cancel into the alternate version of the super again. Then you're going to let the super does what it does again. It's going to bring them down to the floor. You're going to wait until you touch the floor. Once you touch the floor, you're going to do a dragon rush. And from the Dragon Rush, you're going to do Quarter Circle 4 Light Attack again and do his level 1 Super. And that is how you do Broly's Touch of Death combo. It's really specific because you need to have the Light Attack, the first hit of the Light Auto Combo whiffing. It has to whiff. But either way, if it doesn't whiff, it does still do a hell of an amount of damage. And if you don't want to spend seven bars to do the whole combo, you can just opt out for three bars. After you do the first super, just do a dragon rush right after the first super and go into your level one super. This combo is very versatile. As long as you get the corner, you go do this combo almost off of any of Broly's moves. So here's me doing a lariat into an assist and follow up with the level 3 into the level 1 and you can even do the larry into sparking and do the full rep of the whole combo it won't be touch of death though but it still be a lot of damage you can do the level the two level threes into the level one just like so If you do this combo off of a jump in, you cannot get the double level 3 to loop. So you have to opt out for to Dragon Rush into the light version of the Larry into the level 1. That's the only way you're going to be able to connect with this combo. Double level 3s off of uh, overhead would not combo at all. And if the timing is a little bit too hard for you, or if you don't want to spend that much meter, you can always opt in for your auto combo once you touch the ground. And then from your auto combo, you can do your air command grab, throw them back into the corner. And you still get a good amount of damage. And if you can't get the timing off of the standing me to um, standing heavy once you hit the ground, you can just do the auto combo and then do the level three once you're in the air. The original level three, not the alternate level three. This combo also works after command grabs, but it's still not going to be touch of death after command grab. So there's that problem. But it still does a sane amount of damage. So it's worth doing if you know you're going to be able to kill the opponent. And if you want, if the time is too hard or you don't want to spend the meter, you can always do the auto combo off the command grab 
and finish with the combo just like so. Mid screen though, Broly is lacking in damage, so you might as well go for the regular wall bounce combos mid screen. And then once you get into the corner, instead of ending off the combo with a regular heavy, you can do a down heavy to do this. So the trick to get the standing heavy to connect after the down medium, you have to, into the standing medium, you have to do the down medium delay standing medium into the standing heavy, and then you're going to be able to connect with the combo. Well, if you really want to do mid-screen combos, you can do light, light, down medium into standing medium into down heavy, and then use the Vegeta assist or any assist that keeps them into hit stun a long period of time to combo if you level um, level one mid-screen. Or if you really, really want to get damage off, you could combo directly into your level three after the slam grab. You can also do jump cancel combos with the help of assist, of, and you could use the lariat to bring him to the corner to do your level one. So a quick damage scaling tip that I want to talk about with Broly is that he's very different from other characters. Normally, with a normal character, if you start off with light attacks and go into a natural B and B combo, it will scale your damage pretty, pretty hard. And if you start off with a down medium to a standing medium, that's the best way to start your combo off in the game. And then the jump in would scale it down a little bit more if you was to extend the combo, but you still get pretty good damage. And it's definitely better than doing with the light attacks. But with Brawly, if you start your combo with light attacks, you actually get more damage than you would if you start off with a down medium instead of a standing medium. So with Broly, it's better to always go with your light attacks to start off your combos than going with a down medium to standing medium because he gets more damage that way. So you got to keep that in mind when playing with Broly. And if you want to get maximized damage, you should always start off with your light attacks into whatever else you want to do. So yeah, folks, that's the end of the road for this video. Hopefully you was able to learn something new today. And if you was able to learn something new, please smash the like button. Also, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Check out some of the past content. Also, links is going to be in the description below for wherever you can reach me at or whatever you want to do. And anyways, peace. Oh,